people. Rick, Jennifer, there were protesters outside opposed to the repeal and replacement of the Affordable Care Act, but here inside this Lexington warehouse, the crowd was very receptive of Vice President Mike Pence's message. I came here today to turn up the heat on a promise that every Republican made to the American people and this president made to the American people. Vice President Mike Pence's visit comes one day before Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell is set to unveil a second version of the Senate's bill to repeal and replace the Affordable Care Act. The first bill was scrapped when 10 GOP senators said they would not vote for it. Among them, Kentucky's other senator, Rand Paul. But I'll give you a word of encouragement. We are very close to achieving what we've talked about for the last seven years. The House of Representatives has already done its job and give another round of applause to Congressman Guthrie and Congressman Barr for stepping up. Let me just take a word and say the President and I couldn't be more grateful for Senator Mitch McConnell's leadership and commitment to an agenda that will make America great again. The President and I believe when the time comes Senator Mitch McConnell and Senator Rand Paul will do the right thing together and we will pass legislation to repeal and replace Obamacare and end the Obamacare nightmare once and for all. Now, towards the end, Pence encouraged the people inside to let their voices be heard to lawmakers, noting that the protesters outside were certainly doing so. Live in Lexington, Mark Vanderoff, WLKY News.